Hey everyone, so uh, I thought of an idea for doing a heating test. Now this is not going to be the most scientific way of doing it and I'm probably going to be doing more heating tests later. But um, what I did was I have the Z3V, uh, the Z3 Plus and then the Z3 Compact. And let me show you first this. Alright, so we got the Z3V. This is running on... Uh, Kit Kat still because they haven't updated it. Then the Z3 Plus and the Z the Z3 Compact are running on Mollipop. And uh, I've disabled data. I've closed out all the apps. Um, they're mostly charged. And um, let me think. I turn off the Wi-Fi. Yeah. So it's. There's going to be other factors that I haven't thought of, but this is the best thing I can think of for now. So we're going to open up all the cameras. All right, and we are going to shoot all this in 4K. Oh, okay, there's 4K there, and here's 4K. All right, and so once these start getting hot, and I haven't really been using them, um, once they start getting hot, we should have a pretty good idea. They're going to get a display message, and I'm going to test the back and see how it feels. All right, so here we go. All right, guys, we have <clears throat> the first camera, and it is actually a pretty surprise. It's a Z3V. So that lasted a little over 10 minutes. And I'm going to, let's see here. Yeah, I guess I'll weave it going and see what happens. All right, there we go. Now it's officially done. And I'll say it feels warm. It's not hot, but it's warm. All right, so now for the last two phones. All right, and there you have it, the Z3 Plus. So that lasted for, well, it's at 12 minutes so far. Let's see how long before it uh, closes out of the app. All right, now we got the Z3 Compact with the same display message. So let's see which one lasts longer. Well, so far I'm pretty impressed with both these devices. Uh, keep in mind this is 4K video, so um, pretty, pretty impressive. We're approaching 19 minutes here.
All right, and there we go. The uh, Z3 Plus. Looks like it lasted about 19 minutes. I'll get an official timer on there later. I'm kind of scared to touch this, actually. Let's see how hot it is. Uh, not bad, actually. It's it's warm. It's hmm, I'm surprised. It's okay. Yeah, it's really not bad at all. I wouldn't even say it's hot. All right, so now for the Z3. Com oh, there we go. All right. So it's, I mean, if you're judging by this video, there's no issue with the heating. Now, I know a lot of people do have issues. Um, it might be some of them, uh, some of the devices might have hardware defects or something. Um, but at least from what I've determined here, it's not an issue for my device. But All right, so just going to, yeah, I'd say this is about the same. It's warm. It's not really hot. Alrighty, so let's see how long these lasted. Alright guys, so here's the details on the video just recorded. So that was 4.09 gigabytes, 7.24 for the Z3 Plus, and 7.43 for the uh, Z3 Compact. And you see this is the 4K video. So let's see how long this is. Okay. All right, so that was 1036. Eighteen forty six. And nineteen seventeen. All right, guys, so there you have it. Um, this was a 4K video test, which is the most uh, intensive camera test we can do anyways. And I'm going to try thinking of some other overheating tests we can do. So uh, basically, in conclusion, at least from this test, I can say that my device doesn't have any issues. Now, there might be some defective units that do have issues, but everything that I've seen so far the first two days, uh, I think that the overheating is very overstated.